This game called Banana is the second most played game right now on Steam. It has more than 800,000 people playing it. In this video, I'm gonna show you how to make this game. First, you're gonna need a picture of a banana. So just go on Google and get one. Next, open Unity and create a new project. Make sure to select the 2D template. Drag the banana picture into the project and then drag it to the scene. Next, we are going to change to the Game tab. On this left panel, we are going to right-click and create a button. Now, we are going to position the button on top of the banana. Just set the position to zero so it's in the middle of the screen. Then, adjust the height and the width to match the banana. Next, we set the opacity of the color of the image to zero so we cannot see the button. Move the text object outside of the button, but make sure it's a child of the canvas. Adjust the position of the text and increase its size. We will also change the color to white. Next, select the camera object and change the color to 8B8000. Now, to implement the counter, we are going to create a new script. We can delete the body of the script. We will create a text mesh pro GUI to hold the text object. We have to mark it as a serialized field so we can assign the text in the inspector. We also need another variable to hold how many times we clicked. Create a new function called update counter and in this function we are going to increase our counter every time the player clicks the banana and we are also going to update the text. Since the text component expects a string, we have to cast our counter to a string. Save the script and drag it to the banana game object. Click on the banana game object and assign our text in the counter text property of the script. Also, if you prefer, you can just drag the text to this field. To update our counter, we have to tell the button that when we click it, it has to call the function that we just created. In the onClick section, click the plus sign, drag our banana game object into where it says none. Now select the function that we made, so select update counter. And that's it. When you run the game, it should be working. If it's not working when you click the banana, it might be because the text is in front of the button. If you go to the scene tab and click on the text, you are going to see that it is too big. One way to fix this is to resize the text, but we can also remove the click detection on the text. So you just go to Extra Settings and disable Recast Target. Now, if you run the game, it should work. Thank you for watching, subscribe to the channel and like the video if it was helpful. Thank you.